guys, so this is part two um, to the Miss Serenity Smith Fifty Shades of Emotions. Um, and I left off and I was saying that I, I used to um, have a hard time keeping a baby in my collection if I had a really bad experience with an artist um, during our transaction. It's like that negative energy would just transfer over to the doll. Like I just, you know, I don't know. Maybe it, like I don't know. I just it just would just irritate me every time I look at the doll. So I just never could really get into it. Um, it happened to me once where I had a baby that used to be the center of my channel, and I used to role play with that baby a lot. Um, way back when she used to have a little attitude. Um, I had some issues with the artist and it got really ugly and um, I just then all of a sudden I just couldn't even role play with the doll anymore. It was so weird but um, now I've gotten to the point where I mean if it's an exceptional exceptional artist and it's not something where they like scam me or something like that um, then I might, you know, I'll probably be able to deal with it a little bit, but the, the doll has to be like one that's so exceptional that I just absolutely love no matter what. So I'm maturing a little bit in that area, um, but a lot about me has changed and with each incident, I know, you know, people are like, oh, you can't change overnight, but with each incident, I'm changing the way I view things. like. You know, um, maybe a few months ago when people would be like copying my content, you know, um, you know, just like, and, and when I say copying, I know this is a huge stigma that people put out there. You know, everybody get an idea from somebody or somewhere. Okay. Um, yeah, we do kind of come up with some stuff that's creative and we do might we might, you know, put our own spin on things or something, but something triggers a thought. So, but when I say copying, I mean like you literally watch my videos and regurgitate everything that I've said. My opinions, my thoughts, my subjects, um, my topics. Um, rather you turn it into a tag or you, you know, just outright just regurgitate all my videos. Um, just redo all my videos. It A couple months ago, I would have been like really irritated, but now I have a different perspective. Um, when, when that last incident happened and I realized that there's a high chance of a particular artist that sought out to try to sabotage me um, then I realized that there was no limits of what people would do in this community um, to either you know try to put put their stuff back on top or to do this get back or to um, throw any type of shade I realized that there's no limits you know there, nobody keeps the gloves on you know what I mean um, so now I I don't even what I do is when I see that um, and I know like okay it's one thing if we kind of feed off each other and we actually interact and everything but when you really don't like me and you talk about everything that I do is in a negative light but yet you do everything you can to be like me um, or be better than me using my materials um, then I know that you you're not it's not coming from a good place and what I do now instead of you know getting upset and you know having a big huge rant about it and all that what I do now is I just don't watch um, I've unsubscribed to so many channels I don't watch um, I do watch occasionally some of them because I'll get an influx of messages like oh my god did you see so and so and so 
so yeah then i go watch and i'll just shake my head through it or whatever um but other than that you know i've learned to to get over it i mean it's like um someone was telling me that how people was throwing shade on uh the gabigails like you know like but yet the gabigails aren't that big you know like i mean like it's not you don't see the gabigails as much as you see the saskias or the um the levi's you see them way much more um on youtube and um like social media you'll see a, a gabigail pop up every now and then you know what i mean but me of course yeah me i collect I got a whole bunch of them, but I'm not the only person that have multiple babies of the same skull. So now I just realized it is what it is, it's shade, and I take it and I keep it moving. I used to um, think that once I get attacked, it's like I kind of like draw up or I'll like get a little nervous or start to shy away from who I really am and stuff and try to curveball my words and sugarcoat things um and i realized that it don't matter what i do people are still going to not like me if they don't like me so now what i do is i just i'm I, what i've decided to do is just keep doing me now there are some things that i do feel like i can work on and improve and I can watch you know how I handle things so I am trying to do that but as far as trying to convince these people that we should be a community and be as one and we should be supporting each other and um, us women of color that are minorities um, in the doll world in the world um, should not be so envious of one another it's like it's 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 more prominent within that particular group and i know some people are going to watch this and be like oh my god i can't believe she said that but it needs to be said it really needs to be said um and i've said it before in a live stream but you know i'm just saying um it seems like it's more shade come within that you know bracket um i love all people i think that you know we as a community as a dog community regardless of um class gender race um sexuality whatever i thought that when i came in this community that none of the other stuff existed i thought racism wasn't in it you know um the jealousy stuff wasn't in it, the spiteful, the hateful. I thought none of that was in it when I first came into the community, but I learned um, after having such an amazing first one to two years um, in the community that things are changing and people are changing it for us. And it's not really going in a positive light. But what we can do is focus on the positive and let go of the negative and what I do like I said I genuinely like literally I was talking to my friend and um, me and her really are really close and I'll be talking to her and she'll be like oh did you see blah 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 and I'll be like I told you I don't watch that person anymore and she's like oh my god I can't believe you really she was like I just be wanting to see you know and I'm like no I, when I when I'm done I'm done I don't watch um, but that's just me um, so I've, I've learned to just keep it clean keep it moving those that are with me are with me those that are not are not there are gonna be people that just gonna dislike you regardless like I've told y'all before my grandma saying is you can't change the way a person feel about you 
If they don't like you, they just don't like you. You can give them a million dollars, they're going to take your million dollars, and they still ain't going to like you. So I ain't out here trying to buy no friendship and kiss no butts because people are going to do what they do. And one thing I know about me is that I'm a genuine person and I'm honest and I'm human. I make mistakes, but I am who I am and that is not going to change. <laughs> I'm getting ready. I'm going on 40 years old. I doubt that this dog community is going to change me into something that I'm not or change me to be this, you know, submissive bumblebee to their hate. I'm not going to submit to the abuse and the online bullying and the shade that be thrown, you know? It's like, <laughs> and forgive me, I, I walk around in these shirts, so it's, it's not towards anybody, but it does kind of fit ignorant as bliss. But stay tuned. I'll be back with part three and like I said it's 50 shades of emotions to collecting and being a youtuber and being Miss Serenity Smith so I'm sure there'll be more shade spilled upon us but if you want to continue to hear what I gotta say and my journey and being a youtuber subscribe hit that bell share this video and we'll be back soon ta ta now Looking at my baby bumblebee. Won't somebody be so proud of me? Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.